Tired of dealing with annoying flies, fruit flies, and gnats in your home? The Zevo Flying Insect Trap is your ultimate solution. Don't wait. Check out the link in the video description now to get your Zevo Flying Insect Trap on Amazon and enjoy a bug-free home today. The nominations for the 76th Annual Primetime Emmy Awards were announced on Wednesday morning, and the stars were quick to take to social media to share their shocked reactions. Sofia Vergara was nominated for her role in Griselda. The Colombian native shared images of herself from the film. Wow! Griselda was my first dramatic role ever, and it took us 15 years to bring her to life, wrote the modern family veteran. I'm incredibly grateful to everyone who was a part of this series. I could have never done this without my director Andre Spays, my co-star at El Underscore Guerra, at Eric Newman Official and the full creative team, my partner and producer at Luis Balaguer One, at Ted Sarandos, at Balabudge, and their team at, at Netflix, and all of the amazing cast and crew. The brunette added, I never dreamed that after Modern Family I would be able to be a part of something as special as Griselda. I'm honored to be recognized alongside Jody, Bree, Juno, and Naomi, incredible women who gave us incredible TV this year. Thank you to the Television Academy for this incredible honor. Red Heart Jean Smart was nominated for her acting on Hacks. She wrote on Instagram, I couldn't be happier and I am so incredibly proud of us. Barbara Streisand penned a note for Instagram. I'm so pleased that Love Will Survive from the Tattooist of Auschwitz has been nominated for a Best Song Emmy this morning. I was moved to record it because of its underlying message, that love can triumph even in the darkest of times. It's an especially relevant thought today. Congratulations to my musical colleagues Hans Zimmer, Kara Tav, Walter Afanasief and Charlie Midnight. And to Synchronicity Films for making this timely and thought-provoking series. Selena Gomez received her first ever Emmy acting nomination for her part in Only Murders in the Building. Gomez was nominated for Outstanding Actress in a Comedy Series. She added a crying slash smiling emoji over the announcement she was nominated on her Instagram stories. Then on Instagram she wrote, a repost in a more professional way, we're thrilled with our nominations. Gomez's co-stars Steve Martin and Martin Short also took home nominations for Outstanding Actor in a Comedy Series with Paul Rudd and Meryl Streep securing nominations for Supporting Actor and Actress in the Hulu series, which was nominated for Outstanding Comedy Series. Showrunner and co-creator John Hoffman said, In order to pull this season off, it meant everyone, from the greatest actress ever to the greatest prop master, swaddling each one of our Pickwick triplets, bringing the most of their love, talent and ensemble spirit. I watched it up close in amazement and today I'm out of my mind thrilled and grateful the Academy has seen them too, and honored so many of our cast and team of artists and collaborators in New York and LA that made our magical third season sing so unforgettably. Kristen Wiig was nominated for for Outstanding Lead Actress in a Comedy Series for Palm Royale. She said, what the? Still in shock over here, she shared in a statement. I'm so happy for everyone that worked so hard on Palm Royale and SNL. And for all my fellow nominees. Everyone at Apple, Lorne Michaels, and the casts, writers, and crews. I can't believe this. Holland Taylor, who plays Sybil Richards on The Morning Show, was nominated for Outstanding Supporting Actress in a Drama Series. Amazing news like a breath of cool air as I'm slogging through this blazing NYC heat to do my matinee of Not Applicable about a 17-block hustle. Lucky, lucky me, she joked. Karen Pittman, who plays Mia Jordan in the show, also spoke out her nomination for Supporting Actress. I am incredibly grateful and humbled by this moment. I'm proud to be nominated alongside so many on the show, fellow actors, directors and artists, she said. And I'm so proud of our show's nomination, as well. Jodie Foster was nominated for True Detective, Night Country. This just feels like a love letter from above, she said in a statement. It's my very first Emmy nomination as an actor and it's especially thrilling to share this joy with our Night Country team. We couldn't love and trust one another more, after holding on for dear life through the snow, finding our way in the dark. Being part of the true detective family with Issa Lopez as our fearless leader is the gift that keeps on giving. Brie Larson was nominated for Lessons in Chemistry for Outs.